ready, sir. Why is it that cancer's come back? Why is it that patients hear those dreaded words that says the cancer has returned, it no longer responds to treatment, the radiation didn't work, the chemotherapy didn't work? Why is it that tumors relapse? That's the technical word for why they return. And the reason is simple but incredibly complicated. Cancers are, by nature, very diverse. They're not one particular disease in one particular location. They're thousands of ever-changing diseases in one location that unpredictably changes and moves to other sites without you knowing it. So you can no longer think about cancer as one disease that responds as simply as that. And ultimately, treatments will always fail. What we work on in our lab, what we try to develop, is a new type of, type of treatment modality known as photodynamic therapy. And this is a light-activated cancer treatment that uses harmless red light to activate harmless nano-sized packages of drugs. By nano-sized, I'm referring to thousands of times smaller than a grain of sand. And we engineer these not only to recognize tumors, but to recognize specifically the types of tumors that are more prone to becoming resistant to radiation and chemotherapy. So <coughs> this treatment that we use, this nanoparticle facilitated treatment with photodynamic therapy, targets the most stubborn cancer cells. Not only that, being harmless in nature, it doesn't harm any part of the body other than the part that's activated by the laser. And so you have laser scale precision. You can literally use a laser to identify where you're going to be activating the drug at which particular site while sparing the healthy tissue. And the most interesting thing about photodynamic therapy is its ability to intrinsically or inherently train the patient's immune system to recognize cancers that have moved and migrated and metastasized elsewhere. So when you treat the primary tumor at the primary location with photodynamic therapy, the immune system becomes educated and says, now I'm going to circulate everywhere and find those small cells that have moved elsewhere, the lungs, the lymph nodes, and other organs. And so this new modality understands that cancers are ever-changing, ever-evolving. It treats all of them pretty much unanimously, but it treats those stubborn ones even better using a safer approach and an approach that makes sure that the patient's own immune system can keep doing the work and keep eliminating the disease every time it tries to come back and every time it tries to spread. And so you go from a simple treatment regimen to something that lasts for a lifetime. You create an anti-cancer vaccine with this approach. Thank you.